Hey, those are shards of glass from my olive oil distillate. Oh no, the cow ate it all. What am I supposed to do now? The idea is somewhat absurd, uh, but as long as I don't have any other... Uh, <sighs> How about that? How about that? We now have a bucket of oil. Okay, um... We still gotta get the Whispering Stone. Great. Now I have a rack with a hatch and strained mushrooms. Let's extract some teeth from this patient's jaws. Could actually work. Maybe I can extract a whispering stone from him that way. He seems to enjoy it. Now look at that. The pliers fit perfectly in its hand. I'll tie the rope to the pliers. That way, I can use the bone hand as an extension and manipulate the pliers from afar. Well then, Brace yourself and go. It's gonna hurt me more than you, buddy. Well, not in a literal sense, of course. Ah, how about that? The Whispering Stone. Finally, I've got it back. Cool. But the next question is, how spot? Oh, he's fine. All right. What are you doing there? What does it look like? I'm putting oil into the grease tube. What? Without <coughs> a funnel? You'll spill it all! Ah, uh, come off it. The planetary system is a highly sophisticated mechanism. It has to be handled with maximum care. <sighs> All right, if you think so, a funnel. If you please. Spot's fine. It didn't hey hurt, you. and he even enjoyed Listen it. Here. Stop that! That's horrible! Nice ear trumpet. Yes, isn't it? It took me all afternoon to construct it. And then I found out it was only because my bookshelf was in such a mess. Well, be that as it may. I'm sure I can come <laughs> out with a different use for it. Maybe a hat. Or a coffee filter. Well, I can make good use of the ear trumpet. Can you? Eureka! So the effort <laughs> wasn't for nothing after all. You can't possibly imagine how much savvy I've gone into the optimal curvature. Not to mention the earwax. Here, you can have it. Yuck. Hey, it'll make a good funnel. There, I 
we've lubricated the planetary system. Excellent! Now, all we need is the Whispering Stone and the Crank Handle. Ooh, I left the Crank Handle outside. Oh, got it. Oh, no, I got it. There. I've attached the Whispering Stone. Excellent! How did you get hold of it? I... you don't really want to know. Oh, uh, in that case, I didn't ask. Please make sure the planets are aligned in the correct order. Uh, sure thing. Aligned in the correct order. What kind of a sketch is this? That's a schematic view of our planetary system. It shows the five planets. Avrius, Hornetus, Vernicus, Silentia, and Rubble. Which one is which? You can tell them apart by their size. You can also distinguish them by their color, composition of elements, and their names. But their size is all that's depicted here. Everyone knows that. All right, wait a minute. This matches this. Okay, I had those backwards. I'd rather not. If I jam the crank between the cockwheels, I might break the whole thing. Maybe I'm the king. There's more to me than meets the eye. In any case, you are a remarkable young man. Now, you just have to take the water of life to the king. You're kidding. No time for complaints. Hurry up. It's almost done. It's almost done. Spot. Oh. Oh. Water's poison. <laughs> Spot. This is a bad time to turn into a cocoon. You've made it. I can hardly believe it. They said only the king would be able to do that. Huh. I was obviously wrong about you. Is the end averted now? It sure looks that way. The only thing that's left is for the king to get better. Everything will be alright at last. This is a day of joy. What happened to Spot? Don't worry. He drank from the fountain of life. He's taken on the next stage of his existence. What? That's a joke, right? Fountain of life? Will you look at him? Spot is dead. He's just a lifeless hunk now. <sighs> He was my only friend. He was always so good-humored, so spry, so alive. <laughs> His ability to change form was legendary. Then he would have liked this last change, too. What? That's... 
Will Spot ever be his old self again? I wouldn't think so, but look at it this way. Change is an important part of life. Yeah, right. Well, he can't argue life with that. Life is such a fabulous thing, full of funny changes. It's nothing more than a cruel joke at your expense that always ends in death. Don't be bitter. You have saved us from the end. This is a moment of joy. Not for Spot. What shall I do now? We're almost there. The fountain carries water at last, and the door to the king's chambers is open too. Now, every second counts. You have to get the water of life to the king. Quick, hurry up. We're going No further questions. We're going to turn the king into a cocoon as well? Now. Oh, yes. Come here! Look for yourself! What is that? The world's collide! Yes! The time has come! This world will come to an end! No, it can't be! I didn't do anything wrong! Ah! Sadwick! You did what you had to do! You have initiated the end! Finally! How do you get through the window? Your destiny is fulfilled! That... that's not fair! I did everything right. You foolish, unlucky fellow. The thing is right. I knew it was a mistake to let you mess with the planetary system. But, but... Don't you just stand there. Do something. Otherwise, all will be lost. That's not necessary. The planetary system is already moving. You want destiny? I'll give you destiny. No! I kill it. Ha! Ha ha! Sadwick, what? What have you done? Why? I, I stopped it, didn't I? What? What was that? What? What's happening here? You unfortunate fool! Why? What's going on? And what happened to the light? You stopped the planetary system! The time stands still. I is that a... a bad thing? You have no idea. What'd I do? Oh... This cannot be a good thing. Ah, Corona, the magnificent castle of His Majesty. And there's not one soul there to stop us. All stand still. Ah, there's nothing better than the taste of stale air. Come with me, Gorney. I want to claim my throne. Mm hmm Do you remember this part of the Easter egg in uh, the last game we played? Chaos on Deponia? <laughs> there really isn't a soul here anymore. The entourage of the king seems to have abandoned this place a long time ago. There has to be somebody here. Well spotted, Gorney. Time is standing still already. The fabric of space and time has been stopped. Yes, but what does that mean in respect to our plan? What does that mean? <laughs> that means somebody was stupid enough to do our job. Ha ha ha! 
<laughs> hey! You! Stop right there. Uh, oh. Isn't that the snoop again? That clown? <laughs> the little man has a refreshing touch of rebelliousness to him. I begin to like him. Come on, Gorny, <laughs> get him. Throw him into the dungeon. And while you're at it, go look out for other troublemakers as well. Oh, good. What a mess. Oh, now there's Can a hole in the floor. Even worse? Hey, Bobby, you hear? Oh, Sadwick, you can't imagine what they've done to me. They took away your favorite pillow. Very funny. You'll soon find out that this is no laughing matter. You can't mess with the Asgill. <laughs> I always thought I'd die the hero's way. Like a real chasky, starving to death, sitting in a tree while wolves wait at the bottom. But in this dismal hole, where is my dignity? We have to get out of here. Out of here? Uh, have you looked outside lately? You'll have to accept it. There's no place we could go. Everything is lost now. Pull yourself together, will you? Uh, give me one good reason. Our prospects might be bleak, but life goes on. Oh, yeah? Even though time itself has stopped? Uh, good point. Uh, life will... Uh, uh, find a way. I'm sure somebody will save us. And who might that be? Uh, Just face it. Nobody will come to save us. We are doomed. I'll get us out of here. You? Aha! That's hilarious. It wouldn't be the first time I escaped the Askill. And how on earth will you manage that? Will you turn somersaults? Or throw cream pies? At least we're still alive. You call this being alive? Being locked up in Luko's dungeon through all eternity? That's worse than death. You're right. Everything is lost. Yes, but... But why? Why me? I'm still so young. Oh, dear. Man, I hate a wire. You really are a sissy. So why shouldn't I moan? The Askill have won. The era of the Chasky is over. For good. Ah, wouldn't that be nice? What use is speed when time itself ceases to exist? What's the point of a good sense of orientation if all the world lies in ruins? All is lost. Ah, oh, forget it. I'm in no mood for letting you drag me down any further. Uh -huh. And that coming from you. You were the one who dragged us all down. What? Yes, exactly. All this is your fault. That's not true. Ah, of course it's true. You thought you can handle everything, didn't you? You thought the world would fall apart if you didn't take action. Have a good look around. You've made the world what it is now. Ah, oh, shut up. Ah, <laughs> oh, shut up. Ooh, we can look at all kinds of stuff. There doesn't seem to be much in this hole besides pebbles. Spot would have loved this. <laughs> Spot would have loved this. The cage is hanging from a pulley wheel that rests freely on the chain with a peculiar design. I wonder if I can use this to my advantage somehow. The cages all hang from the same chain with a peculiar design. There doesn't seem to be much in this hole besides pebbles. Spot would have loved this. Not a chance. I can't reach them from here. I could at least reach one of them. Oh, the crowbar. The Askill have left my crowbar here. I can't see my other things anywhere. Reach it? Not a chance. Nope. Mm. I can't reach it. Why do I always get myself in this kind of trouble? I hate my arms. Too short to reach the door. Too long to play the violin. Hey, hello. What's going on here? What do you want, you snip? I want to talk to Luko. Luko is the king now. He is busy with ruling. And you'll have to grant me an audience. He has to, does he? I suspect he'll see that differently. I'd like to hear that from him. <laughs> you are a brave little snip. What is it that you want from him anyway? 
I want to complain. I don't believe.